Hello guys, welcome to Everything Metallurgy and welcome to day 65 of 100 days 100 concepts. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about high top pressure in blast furnace. So what is this high top pressure and why we actually use it? Okay, so basically we know in blast furnace, we inject hot blast from the tubes with a very high pressure. So the gases that are flowing in, I mean from the to a region to the topmost region has some good amount of pressure in it okay so that is not the pressure that we are talking about this is a different kind of pressure which we intentionally provide okay in the top region or the upper region of the furnace okay so there are various ways Okay, usually uh, what people do is they tend to, you know, uh, generate power. Usually you have some turbines, okay, where you can generate this pressure, okay, the pressure of the top gas coming out and they rotate it so that some energy is generated out and while rotating, they'll also make a route such that this, uh, there will be a pressure build up in the same route inside the furnace. So what happens in this way? there can be some pressure put from the top of my furnace also okay there are many other ways this is uh, one of it which uh, people use to actually give top pressure inside the blast furnace now let's see why this is uh, you know necessary or what are the important aspects that this will affect on the first thing is it will increase the fuel uh, sorry it will increase the furnace productivity okay firstly it increases the furnace productivity and it also increases fuel efficiency okay that means you can also say this uh, high top pressure will decrease the coke rate the coke consumption used per one ton of hot metal produced okay so let's see how uh, this is actually affecting these two so this is my furnace and you are actually pressurizing from the top and what this pressure does this pressure we actually oppose the gases which are flowing okay to the top or in this direction right that is what is the direction of my gases okay so this HTP which I am providing here is actually not allowing my top gas to easily escape out of the furnace okay so because of which there will be good gas flow inside the furnace okay the gas flow inside the furnace will be good enough or it will be improved or the resist resident time will improve the resident time in the sense the resident time of the gas inside the furnace okay so there will be good gas flow within the furnace not escaping outward and this is happening due to this HTP and now as this gas flow is increasing what will happen usually we know what is indirect reduction right indirect reduction is the reaction between a solid and a oxidizing gas right oh sorry here in our case it's a reducing gas right so usually uh, my feo or iron ore is reduced by the top gases which may be co okay usually co right so here what happens is because there is good time available for the reaction to take place the reaction will be more feasible the indirect reaction will be more feasible that means it can easily occur and it can also occur at a faster rate okay because of which there will be an effect on the furnace productivity right definitely if the reduction reactions are taking place more easily then the production the furnace production will also increase okay this is how providing high top pressure can actually increase the furnace productivity now let's come to the second part which is my fuel efficiency so how fuel efficiency can be improved or how we can decrease the fuel consumption so fuel here is nothing but my coke right so remember what is the solution loss reaction 
सो यूजली सोल्यूशन लॉस रिएक्शन मीन सी ओ सॉरी सी ओ टू प्लस सी गिवस राइज टू टू सी ओ राइट सो इफ माई सी ओ टू गैस इज रिएक्टिंग विथ कोक इट यूजली जनरेट सी ओ एंड दिस इज नॉट सूटेबल फॉर अस इफ इट इज टेकिंग प्लेस इन द अपर स्टैक रीजन राइट दैट इज वन वी आर एक्चुअली टेलिंग सोल्यूशन लॉस दैट मीन्स देर इज सम कोक लॉस वाई बिकॉज दिस कोक इज नॉट एक्चुअली कम्बस्टेड हियर इन द ट्यूअर रीजन इंस्टेड इट इज रिएक्टिंग विथ सम अदर गैस टू फॉर्म सी ओ हियर इन द टॉप रीजन इट सेल्फ ओके सो थिंक अबाउट इट इफ सी ओ इज फॉर्मिंग हियर एट द ट्यूअर्स और सी ओ फॉर्मिंग हियर एट द टॉप विच इज एक्चुअली हेल्पफुल फॉर अस विच इज एक्चुअली यू नो यूज इन ए मच एफिशियंट वे डेफिनेटली दिस गैस प्रोवाइडेड इन द रेस वे राइट वाई बिकॉज इफ माई सी ओ इज जनरेटेड हियर लेट से दिस कैन ईजिली स्केप आउट इट इज नॉट एक्चुअली रिएक्टिंग विथ ऑल दीज लेयर्स विच वी हैव हियर करेक्ट सो दिस इज नथिंग बट माई कोक लॉस और सोल्यूशन लॉस इट इज एक्चुअली कन्वर्टिंग माई कोक प्रेजेंट इन द टॉप रीजन टू सी ओ विच कैन ईजिली एस्केप आउट विदाउट इन्वॉल्विंग इन मच ऑफ द रिडक्शन रिएक्शन सो टू कंट्रोल इट हाउ एच टी बी कैन यू नो कमिंग पिक्चर सो हियर इफ यू केयरफुली ऑब्जर्व सो सिंपल यू कैन ऑल्सो गो एंड टेक थर्मोडाइनमिक एस्पेक्ट बट सिंपली इफ यू वॉन्ट टू सी जस्ट कंसिडर ली शार्ट लियर प्रिंसिपल वॉट इज ली शार्ट लियर प्रिंसिपल इन टर्म्स ऑफ प्रेजर इफ यू इंक्रीज प्रेजर वॉट वॉट इज द डायरेक्शन ऑफ द रिएक्शन इट विल टेक प्लेस फ्रॉम हाई नंबर ऑफ मोल्स ऑफ गैसेस टू लो नंबर ऑफ मोल्स सो हियर वी आर इंक्रीजिंग द प्रेजर सो हियर वी हैव टू मोल्स हियर वी हैव ओनली वन मोल ओके एनी वे कोक इज कार्बन सो वी आर नॉट कंसिडरिंग इट वेन वी आर इंक्रीजिंग द प्रेजर एज ए सेड हाई नंबर ऑफ मोल्स टूवर्ड्स लो नंबर ऑफ मोल्स दैट मीन्स द बैकवर्ड रिएक्शन इज एक्चुअली मोर फीजिबल वेन यू हैव हाई प्रेजर दैट मीन्स ए बैकवर्ड रिएक्शन इज टेकिंग प्लेस वेन यू हैव हाई टॉप प्रेजर वॉट इज बैकवर्ड रिएक्शन बैकवर्ड रिएक्शन इज एक्चुअली not giving me co it is not actually converting my coke or it is not allowing my coke to form co in the upper region so this is the reason or this is the process by which htp is actually suppressing my solution loss reaction that is taking place in the upper stack right so what if this happens this also tells me that there is no loss of coke taking place so my fuel efficiency increases let me let's say previously you are using 100 kg per ton of hot metal okay these are just random numbers if you are using 100 kg coke with high top pressure you may only consume 80 kg coke and this is good for us right we are saving some money correct so this is one important you know um effect of htp number 1 is to affect the furnace productivity and number 2 is actually increasing the fuel efficiency by suppressing my solution loss reaction right so there is also one more important um, effect desiliconization okay what is desiliconization removal of silicon that is present in the hot metal to slag okay desil uh, desiliconization will be rapid when you have htp why in the same you know uh, principle of lee shart lear you can explain it so basically there is this particular reaction taking place when sio2 react with dissolved carbon it usually exchanges that means uh, silicon will dissolve and it forms two co gas okay so again you can see that here only one gas uh, you know species is present and here you have two moles on the product side and zero on the reactant so so definitely when you increase the pressure you also see the backward reaction is more feasible so silicon is actually reacting with 2 co to gives sio2 in slag right so what is happening here silicon which is present in my hot metal is easily removed out and this is very good for us we don't want more silicon in the hot metal due to various reasons one of which is it will actually favor the solidification of the hot metal in the hearth okay so that's why removal of silicon is very very important okay so these are some important effects of high top pressure and why people have modified and bought in the usage of high top pressure in the modern blast furnaces so i hope uh, you understood the concept 
so if you like it please hit the like button and also share with all the gate metallurgy aspirants and also don't forget to fill in the form if you are interested to join our live batch and details are coming soon in the next video so yeah that's it from this video thank you guys thanks for watching